Welcome back to Championship Court where I have James Ignatovich here with me who just earned his spot in the finals for this Sunday. Even though we saw the semifinals, tell me about the quarterfinals. Yeah, in the quarterfinals, I played against Christian Alshon. Um, a lot of people going in thought it would be close, and uh, those people were wrong. Um, it was close. It was close at 0 0 2, or 0 0 1 rather, in singles, and then from there, I just proceeded to to dominate him, and honestly, I'm glad that it wasn't on camera because something like that shouldn't even be publicly available. Jay is a great guy, and uh, he, he definitely is, uh, it's tough to stay focused against him because he's just, you know, so handsome and, and like French and stuff that sometimes I gotta call time out and try to just center myself and, and, and focus on the ball. Uh, speaking of the cramping in your leg, how does it feel and what happened to make you pull through in the end? The monkey's off my back in daddy's home, just so you know. Big Papa Jimmy, monkey's off the back. Daddy's home, let's go. I don't remember what the question was. Sorry, I'm, I'm cramping, like I'm just really in a lot of pain. The men's doubles final, which is the one that we all wanted to be in, I mean, I think, uh, for me at least, like that's my favorite event. And I'm not in that one. Uh, played like crap yesterday, but. Uh, so I think all of us are wondering, how much pickle juice did you drink and how much mustard did you eat since Friday? Um, I actually had uh, a lot of mustard in the third game of that mixed semifinal. I don't know who here saw that, but I think it goes to your head because I was uh, I was a little delirious there in that in that interview. I don't know if you were expecting an interview like that one, then I don't I don't know what to tell you because that was that was interesting. But uh, so yeah. If you want to act normal, don't have mustard for your cramps. I'm going to blame that on, on, on the interview. So. James, how do you feel? Well, it, it feels good because um, for the seven people that, that follow Christian Alshon on Twitter, uh, he predicted that he would be a PPA gold medalist before me. Um, so now I've done it twice, and he's done it zero times. So thank you, everybody.